Where was he? Where's the key? After that, Dad carried the stranger to our guest room. He thanked me. Hello? Hello, hello, uh, Nick? Uh, hey, little Nicky, it's me, Michael. And hey, you don't say anything back to me, okay? There are monsters around that'll hear you if you do. Now, don't be scared, Nick, okay? Listen to me, and we can defeat those monsters, all right? <coughs> Okay, so these monsters might look, uh, surreal. Uh, you know, don't look at them too long or you'll feel weird and see creepy things. When you do, turn on your desk lamp next to your bed. You'll feel safe there. Uh, the more you stare at the scary monsters, the worse you'll feel. All right, uh, all right, all right, all right. Um, okay, first things first. Uh, Freddy, uh, the fuzzy brown bear. Uh, he's at the window, Nick. Uh, he'll peek inside. Close your curtains and keep them closed until you hear him leave, or else he'll get inside. Uh, then there's Bonnie, the uh, ill-tempered big purple bunny. Uh, keep an eye on your door. He'll be there. Uh, he's not shy at all. Uh, he will knock on the door to let you know he's there. But once he opens the door, shut off the lights as fast as you can, Nikki. He can't see you well in the dark, and he'll leave. Uh, oh, but make sure you're sitting down when you do that, all right? Okay, uh, then there's the chicken. That one's a little bit weird. Um, check the closets often. Uh, if she's peeking through, make sure to disable the lights. Uh, she doesn't want to be seen, but ignoring her doesn't help either. If she does catch you with the lights on, she'll scare you and stun you. Now look, I, I know this is a lot to take in, little Nikki, okay? Just, just listen carefully and try to remember it all. Please, okay? Alright, last is Foxy. Uh, he'll be right beneath your bed, Nick. You'll hear scraping from the bottom of the crib when he's there. Uh, be watchful if you see his hook on the back of your bed, because soon enough he'll be right there next to the bed. Uh, don't look directly at him, Nick. Instead, pretend to sleep. All right, just pretend to sleep. Yeah, just lie down without moving too much. Look up and close your eyes. Uh, Foxy sees eyes as if they're big, bright spotlights, okay? So if you pretend to sleep, he won't know you're there anymore. But don't open them until you know he's gone, okay? Okay, uh, so to recap, um, Freddy is at the window, so if you see him peeking, close the curtains until he's gone. Uh, Bonnie will knock on the door and open it afterwards. Uh, disable the lights and sit down until he leaves. Chica will try to stun you by scaring you, so if you see her peeking through the closet, shut off your lights and don't pretend to sleep. She'll think you're gone. And Foxy will appear under your crib and move upwards, so when he's next to your bed, pretend to sleep until you hear him leave. All right, you got all that? All right, good. Uh, listen, I have to go, little buddy, okay? Just hang in there. Oh, they'll leave at 6 a.m., I'm sure of it. You can do this.
really think it was a good idea letting him stay. Well, it's not like he was in any condition to do anything. Did you see his clothes? It's like he came out of a bonfire. I mean, I could have, uh, you know, called an ambulance, maybe dropped him off near a hospital would have been better. I, I just don't think I'd feel comfortable with a complete stranger just ending up sleeping in our house is all. Oh, honey, are you worried about the kids? Of course I'm worried about the kids. He's sleeping right next to them. How can I not be? What if he's faking, Val? We could stay here to make sure nothing happens, if you're that worried. All night? <laughs> of course all night. Come on, don't you want to spend time with me more? You are done updating your site for the anniversary. How about we just sit here in the living room and watch some TV while we keep an eye on the kids? I mean, uh... Sure. I guess. Yeah, I guess we could do that. I... I've just got to go make sure one more time nothing's wrong, all right? I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I'll just stay right here. But don't take too long. <laughs> you worry too much. <gasps> what, uh, what was that? Someone there? And if anyone can hear me, please respond immediately. Who is it? What in God's name is going on here? Oh, uh, it's me, Michael. Uh, look, there's no time to explain. Just know that you are in grave danger. Is Scott there with you? My husband? No, he isn't. He, he just went to... What do you mean I'm in danger? Uh, Ma'am, I am very, very sorry. This is all my fault. You need to stay calm. I'll try to help you through this. Just please listen to me very carefully. What? Listen, there are monsters that are going to arrive to your room real soon. If they see you, you are dead. Do you understand that, ma'am? And it's very important that whatever occurs, just don't let them see you. All right? I... I... I know, I know. Look, just... <sighs> You're in the living room, right? Try to focus on the three entrances behind you. The exit to the house should be locked and they won't come through there. If there are any monitors nearby, then they should be forced to produce a camera system for you. Ma'am, is the TV in your living room turned on? Uh, yes, but it's filled with static. Uh, all right, uh, please keep an eye on it. It should help you. Look, they usually come from either the left side or the right side. You have nothing to stop them, so if you see one of them about to enter the room, just hide. Hide? Hide where? Uh, just... Look, look, just stay out of sight, okay? Yes, if they try to come in, just move somewhere they won't be able to see you, okay? Well, I don't know which one will come from which side, but if you look at the TV, you might be able to tell by yourself. Uh, and maybe if you can, try to see if you can look through the doors, too. Uh, windows, uh, keyholes? Yes, uh, keyholes! If any of your doors has a keyhole you can peek through, keep checking it. They won't notice you on the other side. Trust me. Uh, so yes, I, I can't stress this enough. If anything comes through those doors, hide. Just hide away from view. You might hear noises later on in the night. Pay attention to those. Don't look at anything that appears in your room and try to stay safe. Please. Do I have to stay here all night? What about my children? What about my husband? Look, it's very hard to explain, ma'am, and no, just wait until 6 a.m. to be safe. But, but, but don't worry, the time will pass much faster. Just keep an eye on the clock and wait for that time. They should all be gone in a few minutes, and then the hours will reset. Now, please, if you survive, I need you to grab your kids and get out of this house as soon as possible. I'm gonna help Scott get out of here myself. Don't worry, just please get yourself and your sons out of harm's way. I... I don't understand what is even happening. How do you know all of this stuff... Wait... Wait a second. How do you know my husband's name? I was there when he found you, Michael. He never said his name. How do you know? Michael? 